What's up guys, CJ here and welcome back to another all new Hybrid Network News Flash. Just four months away from its release in May, the news about Godzilla King of the Monsters just keeps coming. Yesterday we brought you an update on the Oxygen Destroyer's role in the film, a confirmation from director Michael Doherty that it is not just going to be a cameo, it is going to be a major plot point in the film, and today we've gotten a brand new look at the movie's big bad, King Ghidorah. This brand new look at the villainous three-headed dragon that's going to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Godzilla in the film comes to us from a variety of sources. First, it comes from an exclusive from USA Today, running down a list of the top films of the year to look forward to now that we are officially in 2019. And in that list, number eight is Godzilla King of the Monsters, and they revealed this brand new image which you see on screen now. In the image, Ghidorah towers over this, this flying fortress that we've seen in the trailers. It kind of looks a little bit like a stealth bomber, but the engines in the back show you this is not a normal plane. This is some sort of futuristic thing. And from what we see in the trailer, it kind of looks like it might almost be like a mobile command center of some sort. Kind of a just a really large plane. I guess the Godzilla universe's equivalent of like a helicarrier is what comes to mind because this is not a normal bomber. And in the background, we see the iconic yellow lightning so often associated with King Ghidorah, which in this movie is is kind of being done in an interesting way as we've touched on in previous videos because he's now got the ability to basically create storms wherever he goes. They just follow him. But the image was also posted on Twitter by Godzilla King of the Monsters director Michael Doherty and he added a little bit of an interesting quote for a caption to the image and upon his head's the name of blasphemy which you biblical folks might recognize as from the book of Revelations uh, describing the beast, the beast of the apocalypse. So Ghidorah absolutely living up to that title. He is bad news and that's being telegraphed basically from, from the highest authority on this film. Let me know in the comment section down below what you make of this new look at King Ghidorah and how big you think he's going to be exactly in the movie. I know we've seen in the trailer that he's at least Godzilla size, if not taller at least. I think Godzilla's still a little bit heftier. He's not looking quite as thick as he was in that 2014 movie, but he's still a, a big dude. Ghidorah, though, looks even bigger, uh, especially, you know, potentially if he stretches his, his necks out, he's actually going to have probably a reach advantage on the King of the Monsters. That's going to do it for me here, though. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to smash that like if you like what you saw. Subscribe for more great content every single day. And consider turning on your notifications to be alerted every time we upload a new video. Signing off, this is CJ, and I'll see you next time.